Here's the deal. You want to start nutrition coaching, but there's one thing holding you back and that's technology. I get it. Maybe you're not good with computers or software or even apps. And the thought of figuring it all out has you feeling stuck and standing still. But don't fear, because in today's video, I'm gonna show you exactly what technology you need to be using as a nutrition coach to be successful and what you don't need, especially as a nutrition coach first getting started. Here's my promise to you, coach. By the end of this video, you'll have the confidence to use technology as a nutrition coach and no longer let technology use you. Here we go. First off, we certified over 420 plus nutrition coaches in our certification, the Dr. Mark method, and they range in age from 18 years old all the way to coaches in their 60s. Everyone has a different experience with technology, AKA they didn't grow up with computers or they literally haven't lived without them. So if you get the feeling that I'm not techie, how could I be online coaching, which I know sets a lot of new coaches back, we want to show you exactly what you need from a technology perspective to get started. Here's Dr. Mark Method coach and resident tech expert, Coach Josie, to show you exactly what you need to get started. One question I get more than anything is, do I need a website to get new clients or a coaching software to deliver my nutrition coaching? And while a website and a coaching software may be very helpful, it is not necessary in order to start nutrition coaching. And in fact, for many new coaches, the financial and time commitments involved with getting these things set up can be a huge barrier to getting started. Instead, you can actually run your entire nutrition coaching system with a few simple tools. Here's how. First, you're going to need an application form. You can create a simple application form using Google Forms, which is completely free to use. This application form is what potential clients will fill out when they want to work with you. The best part, you can create one of these application forms in minutes using Google Forms, as well as share it directly to people who are interested in learning more about your coaching. Using this simple application form is a great way for new clients to get in contact with you and it eliminates the need for a fancy or really expensive website when you're just getting started. Second, you'll need a nutrition tracking sheet. Now we are moving into talking about your actual coaching system. First, let's talk about how you'll actually deliver plans and collect information from your clients using a nutrition tracking spreadsheet. As a nutrition coach, you will need a way to collect information from your clients and review it. And this is where a simple Google sheet does it all. The spreadsheet you see on screen right now is the exact spreadsheet that all of the coaches in this video run their entire nutrition coaching business around. And not only is this simple for our clients to use, it's free for us and it gets our clients great results. Now, if you're worried about how you are going to create a spreadsheet like the one on screen here, do not worry, we've done all the hard work for you. You can download our tracking sheet template at the first link in the description below, complete with instructions on how to use this and customize it for your business. The next part of your coaching system is gonna be your client check-ins. For your check-ins, all you're gonna need is another simple Google form. You'll use this form to gather your client's information and get feedback about how things are going and their progress. Once a client fills out your form, it's time to respond. You can do this simply by using email or a personal favorite of ours here at the Dr. Mark Method that is to record a Loom video going over your client's check-in that you send directly to them via email. So that's it, between Google Forms, Google Sheets, email and loom that's all you need in order to run your nutrition coaching business and if you want to know exactly how to organize your nutrition coaching process and use all of these tools for yourself go ahead and click the first link in the description below amazing thanks coach josie hopefully that gives you a better idea of what you need to get started especially from a software or website perspective it's not as complicated as you think and if you want some more direction and resources to get started maybe you want to download those tracking forms and check-in sheets we already talked about in this video, you can go to the first link in the description below and get instant access to them. Now you may be thinking, I really want to wow my clients and provide them with a professional coaching service. And that means including technology. But what does that actually mean? Next up, we have Coach Shobana from the Dr. Mark Method, who's going to show you exactly what technology she uses with her clients, which are primarily from South India, to deliver a professional coaching service that works. Hey, I'm Coach Shobana and I work with South Indian vegetarian women over 40 get stronger, leaner and healthier as they head into menopause. Although my clients are tech savvy, they are super busy. They want most of the information accessible from their phone very quickly. So I have found ways to use technology that they are already comfortable with using. For example, we use WhatsApp for everything, check-ins, sharing updates, resources. It's simple 
and it works because it's all in one place for the client. They also love live meetings. So I organize to have sessions with women who have similar lifestyle and background so that we can discuss their wins and their obstacles and the struggles that they face to reach their goals. We chat about progress, set goals and strategies on what worked for them and support each other. Honestly, it's about keeping things easy and adaptable because every client is different. I have learned to use just enough tech to make things smooth without overcomplicating it. At the end of the day, the best tools are the ones that actually fit into their life. Thanks, Coach Shobana. I can't tell you how many times I went into a coaching environment, being the client, either in health and fitness or business, and the coach uses a tool that I don't understand or don't even really need. It doesn't always make for a good experience. And sometimes a simpler tool is only what you need to get the result. As coaches, we need to find that balance between sticking with our guns and doing things that we know are in the best interest of the client, and that may mean using new technology, but also meeting them where they're at, which may mean using the simplest tool for the job. Okay, at this point, you might be thinking, well, what about the social media thing? It's online coaching. I know I need to be present in social media. What do I do with videos? Do I need to edit those? How do I actually take them? And I'm sure on your own social media feeds, you see some amazing things out there and you're wondering, how do those coaches do it? And at the same time thinking, I didn't get into this to be a graphic designer or a video editor. I just wanna help people. Here's Coach Meredith from the Dr. Mark Method, who I will say has come a long way when it comes to using technology in her coaching. And if she can, so can you. So she's gonna tell you about that. She's gonna share with you the social media strategy that works for her in terms of taking videos and creating content. I will be the first one to admit that I used to have a very fixed mindset when it came to technology. I used to tell myself all the time that I wasn't very tech savvy and I can recognize now that I was standing in my own way of becoming better at it. Now we can have fixed mindsets in some areas and growth in others. And as a certified health mindset coach, I know now that I was really holding myself back. So developing a growth mindset is going to be accepting that Maybe you're not good at technology right now, but that you can become better at it. And that mistakes and mess ups and not knowing how to do something right, right away is part of the learning process. And it doesn't mean that you can't get better at it. You just have to continue to put some effort into it. I started utilizing things like YouTube tutorial videos, and I just got comfortable with feeling uncomfortable with technology. And I gave myself a lot of kindness and compassion and grace to learn how to utilize these different tech things so that I could grow my online nutrition coaching business and become more efficient with my time and energy. I'm still not the best at technology, but I definitely have come a long way over the last few years. Now, I still don't love technology, so I try to cut corners a little bit and avoid doing the things that don't bring me very much joy. And one of those things is I don't really love editing videos and I want to still show up for my followers and create good content for them, as well as remain as authentic as possible and feel like I'm showing up as myself. So one of the things that I have found that has worked for me is to utilize my stories. Now, what I do is I show up on my stories pretty much on a daily basis, and I make sure that those stories are set to automatically download to my phone. And then I can pull that video clip with the captions and everything from my phone, upload it into Instagram as a reel, add a caption and hit post. This saves me time and energy. And I also get to avoid doing editing of videos that I don't really enjoy doing. Amazing. This approach is clearly working for coach Meredith to get clients and to show up on social media consistently. So maybe it'll work for you too. And there you have it, folks. That's what you need to know about technology in your nutrition coaching business especially as you're getting started. If you want to download any of the resources that we talked about today, check out the links in the description below. And as great as those tips are, if you're really serious about starting a nutrition coaching business, you're going to want to check out the next video I've linked up right here. If you do want to start working in some software or different tech tools into your nutrition coaching business, I'm going to detail what are the best ones for you to use as a nutrition coach in this video right here. So check it out now and I'll see you in the next video.